Kia ora everybody and welcome back. Today I've got a very special little game to show you in a very special little video. This is Mini Motorways. I'm pretty excited about it. A fairly new release on Steam, although I think it has been floating about the place somewhere for a while. Uh, beautifully designed, great soundtrack. This is a very simple uh, city builder. Very simple transport simulator, but don't let its simplicity fool you. It's not boring and by no means is it easy you see simplicity and ease are not the same thing so i think we should probably jump into los angeles that feels about right let's just jump straight in and have a look at what this beautiful little indie game has to offer initially i entitled this video uh the best ten dollars you'll ever spend and for good reason because seriously this is a really fun little game <laughs> So, as you can see, there are shops and houses of different colors, right? And basically the whole premise of the game features around this, connecting shoppers to their desired shopping destination. Or I guess you could think about this as a factory and these are the workers. However you want to frame it in your mind, this is fundamentally the fundamental core of the gameplay. And you might say, well, this is a little bit easy, what's going on? Well, up the top here, you see I have some speed controls. I can turn it on to fast forward and we can speed through this easy bit. Because what will happen is, as we complete journeys and fulfill these, these little markers here on the shops being the sort of uh, quests or the items that these people are picking up, the objectives they have to complete, whatever you want to call it, that's what they're doing. Now, this is where it gets a little bit more interesting. I'll turn the game speed back to normal. Now what you can see is we have different colors. These colors ideally shouldn't mix together, which is of course not how we'd usually like to live our lives, but this is a weird game. So you see, I can pause it here. What I could do is connect these reds up like that and then connect this one down here like that and everything would be connected. And actually, you know what? For the time being, that'll probably work fine. However, the whole aim of the game is to try and keep up with these. Yes, exactly. Someone has to deliver these Uber Eats, right? Somebody has to deliver the Uber Eats, somebody has to collect their shopping, or whatever it's gonna be. We need to ensure that people can get to these destinations in time. And I don't know about you, but to me, when I look at intersections, particularly like this one in the middle, and this one down here, I'm thinking, oh, we might run into issues in the future when traffic really builds up. You'll notice another thing up the top right here, this counter. This is counting how many journeys we successfully complete, and that will be our high score. So, at the end of each week, we get given uh, something else to place down on the map. It may be road tiles, it may be bridges, it may be roundabouts, traffic lights, that's right, Ben. All of these different things we can get. Uh, I don't think there are any bodies of water, so I guess I'll go with the traffic lights in this case. Oh, there is, the, there is a river. I didn't even, I'm a moron. Luckily, we do already have a bridge. So <laughs> we have one bridge. You can see my tiles down the bottom here. 27 roads, two traffic lights, and a bridge. I don't like this intersection at all. I'm going to speed up time a little bit just so that we can pass through the game. You can see the counter up the top right. Whammo, there we go. That's a pretty easy connection to make. But you can see this is already a mess and I hate it in every way, shape, or form. So we need to plan ahead, right? We really need to plan ahead. So if I right click on these roads, I can delete them and just completely erase them from existence. What we need to do is try and connect the reds on their own transport line and the oranges on their own. This red house is really annoying where it is right there. I don't like that at all. What I would prefer to do is connect around the back. So say we go like, uh, not like that. Let's just go like around, snake around like what is that road? Snake around like that. Get rid of that. Uh, bring these oranges together like so. And then this red one is just kind of awkward and ruins everything. Let's just see if we can leave them disconnected. We'll see how we go. <laughs> Roundabouts could very much save me in this situation. In this situation. But I don't know. I mean, I, I kind of like what I've done here. Roundabout may be necessary. Uh, we don't, we haven't quite got any, but I do have a lot of roads. So much so that actually, like, I could probably just, for the time being, go like that. Right? I've still got 13 roads. Look at that. How beautiful. 
is that. <laughs> so, there's our solution to our strange pro- and here's another strange problem. This is what Mini Motorways does really well. It's it's predictable but slightly unpredictable at the same time. Now we have the need to build bridges, of which I only have one, so we're not even going to be able to connect these up particularly nicely. For the time being, wow, okay. This changes things because we can instantly connect that up. We can also slide that guy in there. I think, actually, we may not even need a bridge yet. Can one house service one shop? Daniel, God Gamer, perhaps, will find out. My question is, can one house service one shop? If it can't, I could actually just bridge these together, actually. If I bridge that together there, then this house can service two, this house can service two. Actually? Actually? Let's just do that. That way we're completely covered. The only thing we haven't brought into the loop is this one orange house. But we have three servicing two. Three servicing two. The enemy is building the bridge. Do not build a bridge. <laughs> so I, I think I'm pretty happy with where this is at. I'm going to speed up. Oh, no. Okay, we're into the next week. Here's some roundabouts. Place roundabouts to reduce... Traffic congestion. They are almost in every way better than traffic lights, and everybody knows it. If the whole world was run on roundabouts, it would be a much happier place. Let's fast forward a little bit. I'm feeling good. I don't need to do any kind of widespread urban planning here. We've got red feeding red. Orange is feeding orange. It is just keeping up uh, with demand by the looks at, what's that, three houses per two. Whammo, here's our new partner. Okay, I think our solution here is to do that. Uh, is that our solution? What what other things do I have? Could round about it. Actually, you know what? This is, this is actually not a very high traffic area at the moment. I think that's fine. Let's just keep playing it. Oh, that makes it slightly worse. That makes it a lot worse, actually. <laughs> that couldn't have gone worse. Uh, that makes red quite difficult to connect. I wonder, like I say though, actually not a great deal of congestion. Um, what we can even do is do some ugly thing like... <laughs> like that, just to keep this road clear for the reds. So now, uh, the, the reds and the blues should, in theory, not cross over too much. Or at least they shouldn't have to stop for each other. Okay. This is the next thing that happens. As we go through the shops upgrades, so you can see this shop's turned into the beehive, and all of a sudden there's a whole load of pressure on me to connect them up. Um, so clearly we need to bring these dudes over into the orange network. Ideally it would be a bridge. But, I wonder, what do we have? We have 20 roads. Uh, we may need to remove this bridge and just have one servicing one here but first and foremost we're going to connect blue neighborhood like so uh that is that is quite possibly the, the just that is horrendous in every way and i'm disgusted in myself uh for doing that okay let's do that connection there this guy is awkward and probably going to be left out these want to be connected and brought over we've only got nine road tiles gonna have to scrap that bridge scrap that road uh other inefficiencies include this hot mess which i don't know wh why I, I did that instead of just doing that uh, <laughs> uh any other hot messes to fix no i think we're good i think we're good yeah we could we could just go around the top we've only got 14 though so we're gonna do a little bit of this action gonna get some roads bring probably make this one the main road this will be sort of our arterial road it will feed in uh there like that is probably f a little bit hideous let's go across like that and then connect in there so we we just sort of ease the friction on that intersection and then for these ones we're just going to horrendously sort of hook them up to the main road like so uh, I think I can leave that one out. Let's see how this handles demand. Uh, worst comes to worst, we can make them go around. But let's just, let's play it out, see how it goes. In fact, even gonna play it out on a slightly higher speed. Ooh, so. 
Next up, we get actual motorways. This is, after all, mini motorways for a reason. So let's choose these, even though the bridge is definitely the better pick for me. I want to play with the motorways, so let's pick them. And... What they really do well is connecting uh, vast areas. You can literally just throw a motorway across. So we can actually use the motorway instead of a bridge and instead of roads too. Let's keep it on fast forward. I think we can keep this ticking along nicely. We can maybe even just plan as we go. We look to be keeping up on all demand. Uh, this is, yeah, from the creators of Mini Metro comes this, Mini Motorways. Really fun little game, uh, available on Steam. I believe also on Apple Arcade, which I think you can play, like, for free, maybe through a free trial or something. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm pretty sure you can play Apple Arcade for free for at least a month. So you can play this game for free on your laptop and stuff if you have Apple Arcade or just, you know, on Steam. It's about 5 or $10. So, this is this is not many this is civ 9 <laughs> oh my goodness all these people need to be connected um and this is a great example of where we could use a motorway let's give it a whirl motorway these people motorway thank you these people no that is n definitely not a motorway motorway give it to me what what is going on? <laughs> Imagine. Wow, what a nice motorway you just built. <laughs> this, I'm just really worried about this. I guess we could just go around. Co competent engineer. <laughs> uh. You've run out of road tiles! So we cannot just road around. It's actually such a long way. Okay, I'm gonna drag this motorway in. Let go there. Drag it across to... Uh, probably just to these houses, right? Because we just want to sh sh literally ship people from this... <laughs> this hot mess of a neighborhood down here. We just want to... Sh thank you, Benjamin. We just want to ship them up. Let's do more roundabouts, even though I haven't had to build one yet. I haven't had to build one at all. Nor have we had to place any traffic uh, lights, so we're feeling pretty good about that. You will note up here, got to five little... Uber Eat Ride things needing to be picked up. So the motorway was an absolute saviour for this strategic city planning simulation. <laughs> um, regular roads only would be pretty tough. Uh, although if you had enough bridges, I guess you could basically just bridge over the entire Los Angeles River and do that. Um, anyway, how are we doing here? Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, six... Everything's looking fine, I think. We've still got this poor, this poor orange house out here. We just, we don't need to connect them. It's very close. We're only sort of just keeping up with demand. Um, oh, that's ugly. So this red one now... Uh, oh, why you do this to me? Oh, why, why, why? <laughs> Stop. Okay. Um... Uh, I mean, look at how spread out red is. This motorway seems like a waste of time. Unless, unless we just use it as the main transport route and then ship people off it still. What I'm thinking is we perhaps use a roundabout here, connecting this red neighborhood, right? One, two, do, do a shoe, turn around 100, right? So we connect them up, boom. We connect these guys up, boom. We remove La Motorway. Oh no, not La Bridge. La Bridge can stay. We remove the motorway. These guys are all... Oh look, we can even connect this guy to it. How about that? Okay, <laughs> now, they all will connect to a motorway, which I cannot place. Freeze frame. Let's delete that. 
Oh, it'll go away once the last car has finished driving along it. A very annoying thing, but we can, we'll just deal with that in the meantime. Hopefully not lose in the process. So, delete those roads. Uh, and... That looks good. Go back into build mode. Um, actually, that looks horrendous. What am I thinking? Hook that up like that. Uh, hook that one in too. So now they all just hook into this super highway. Oh, actually though, we can leave them with this road create a nice wee cul-de-sac now they can get to that one or they can go to the motorway where they will hook on from this roundabout over here to a second roundabout like so the motorway will connect straight onto it onto a little road that is going to spring off it not like that yep good job great work like that <laughs> uh although actually it'll probably want to connect on down here no down here sure so the motorway will connect on there do, do, do. it'll service that place and this one and it'll go down to here and also service these brilliant or brilliant on a scale of one to brilliant how brilliant will that be I think brilliant unfortunately uh, at the moment they're not connected at all so maybe we'll just do that for the time being uh, because our motorway seems to still be being used <laughs> motorway delete me not extra road tile by the bridge oh my goodness the wasted road there we go okay now Thank you, <laughs> thank, thank you, Tarvin. Now, um, I can put my super motorway down. Oh, hold on, hold on. Uh, motorways are, oh, are you for realsies? Are you for realsies? Let's get another motorway. <laughs> okay, so, uh, green connects to green. That's actually totally fine. We don't need to connect them at all. And then let's go super, oh, hold on. As I was saying before we got rudely interrupted, we need a road to come off this because motorways cannot connect straight onto roundabouts, but you can trick them by literally just building a road straight off it and rump connecting there and we'll just put this uh, like so. Great direct connection, feeding red and blue to red and blue. Very good, very good. I like this a lot. Let's get back to what we were doing. <laughs> it does make you wonder, doesn't it? When you look at these houses, you think, really? That is the best place you could build? Really? Like, you chose to build in the middle of no... Or, like, under a motorway? Like, what? what? <laughs> when there's all this, this beautiful Santa Monica Bay beachfront property and you're building up here? What is wrong with you? Madness. However... Uh, I'd like to reduce... Oh, yeah, there we go. We just connect that there. Uh, and maybe... I'm just thinking these reds actually can't get to that, can they? Is that a bad thing? Probably. This motorway prob... Whoa, whoa, whoa. This <laughs> road. We may need another connection here just for a little bit of traffic to filter through. We'll keep an eye on it. What we need to be really keeping an eye on is these dots as well. We need to make sure that none of these buildings fall too far behind. I don't think they should now. I think we're pretty well connected. And you're right, this is probably a much better example of urban planning than the actual LA. Uh, <laughs> although, I don't know. I mean, look at, as I'm looking at this map, it doesn't strike me as uh, a particularly appealing place to live. Transport and logistics wise, it is functioning completely as intended. Uh, but in terms of livability, I don't know, maybe not for me. I can barely even see to connect this house up. We'll connect these under the motorway as well, I reckon. Although, we'll just have to make sure something's going on a little bit dodgy down here. Why is that happening? Why is that happening? Reds are... This one is still just servicing this one, I love that. These five reds, perhaps this connection is too far away for them to get down here in time. Where, oh, but the blues are struggling too, so if I move it any further away from the blues, they're going to run into some difficulties. We do have another motorway, so we could think about just connecting, giving red their own and giving blue their own. Um, 
Oh, thank you, Hannah. Um, let's just play... Oh, my goodness. What is this? Can you not? We've run out of road tiles. Why? <laughs> Why? How have I been so inefficient? I mean, I can see some inefficiencies here. Let's connect this blue. Connect this blue. That's an ugly T intersection, though. Connect them... Oh, I, I see you. Okay, that's fine. Um, gonna have to motorway some people just straight up to this factory, I think. Every, like, at the moment we seem to be handling demand everywhere else, but we're not gonna be able to handle this, potentially. And I don't want to use this red neighborhood to get to it. So, for the time being, <laughs> we're gonna do the ugliest thing imagine- oh, hold on. I need a road. Uh, where can I steal our road from? Here and here and just shorten these a little bit. Like that. Um, all these snaky roads don't need to be quite so snaky. But what I, all I really need is just like one road like that. And then we'll just sneak a motorway in like the, the, the ugliest motorway in the world. <laughs> Let's play that out, see what happens. <laughs> no. No, this is not a sponsored stream. <laughs> this is not sponsored in any way. Um, I really just need road tiles. Really desperately need road tiles. Now we can afford to be a little bit more creative with this motorway. If demand requires it, but at the minute it doesn't look like it is requiring it. Uh, potentially we can speed up the journey of these red boys by connecting through there. Uh, can I get rid of this connection altogether? I probably shouldn't. What we could try and do is put some traffic lights here as well. That might just help with congestion uh, because this is a, potentially a bit of a bottleneck and I would just want to make sure that I stay on top of it. <laughs> just living under the like like this person thought they had this beautiful home and I just smashed a motorway over top of it <laughs> after ridiculing them for not living in nice places they're like fine we'll go live out in the middle of nowhere so they travel out into the middle of nowhere and whammo I slam a motorway on top of their head gotta love it uh, I need to keep an eye out for little houses that pop up that aren't connected along the way too also kind of worried about what color factory is going to be built here I think we've got lots of roads, don't we? Yep. That is actually... Oh my goodness gracious. That is actually a non-issue. Let's connect that up. Oh, this is a little bit of a... Oh, I got blocked from building that road instantly. What the heck, man? Oh, this is a disaster waiting to happen now. Connect you... Uh, bridge, bridge please, bridge please, let's pause. Okay, um, this has just turned into some unholy nightmare. <laughs> I mean, it's horrendous. <laughs> you can't connect a motorway to this intersection, but I can connect this intersection to a motorway? <laughs> yup. Okay, <laughs> whatever. Um, okay, actually, this blue is fine. These oranges are mostly fine, except for this weird one, which I guess is just gonna loop around like that. Actually, you know what? That's okay. That's actually better than okay. That's really tidy. I like that a lot. Um, let's tidy this one up to... There we go. This is looking a bit better. Um, you can probably sort of do like that as well. You can do that. Look at that. Really minor things make a big difference, don't they? Now I actually look like I've thought this through in some way. Oh my goodness, he thought it through. This is an unholy mess. Uh, thankfully, it's mostly internal, so I don't know if it'll be a problem. And you know what? This motorway is actually working just fine. I think we're totally fine. My only concern is, will this have enough people to service this, this, and this? How are they getting there? They're jumping on this roundabout and being ferried along to this roundabout. So what we probably need to do then is, what on earth, why did it jump there? What we're probably going to need to do is connect that up like that. And then I guess feed this person onto it. 
Uh, we can probably get away with not feeding this person. Ah, uh, we'll feed them onto it as well. Fine. You choose to middle live in the middle of nowhere, but we will provide you with some sort of basic service, I guess. There we go. All right. We're all sorted, I think, team. We're all sorted. Ah, oh, I would love, love a, um, a, a, <laughs> I would love to do some, like, multi-level roundabouts. They're unfortunately not in this game. There are lots of interesting transport features that aren't available yet. I say yet because I have high hopes for the, what on earth is going on down the bottom here. Red. Red, man. What's going on with Red? Oh. Red have no way of getting to where they need to go quickly at all. Um, because this motorway, this isn't servicing them fast enough, I don't think. I think they're getting really congested potentially through here as well. This intersection is causing big problems. Um, what we might do for the time being is hook that up with a bridge. Uh, and then perhaps... See, what I would love to be able to do, again, advanced feature, I'd love to be able to tunnel under, right? That would be really good. Be really good. Um, I guess bridges is all... Bridges is sort of solves the problem, yeah. Um, oh, hmm. We need to connect these reds up quicker as well. They need to get here. It's still such a long journey, though. And I don't really want to cross over, but I don't have any transport tools left to use. Are there any that I could get rid of? I mean, potentially this roundabout maybe doesn't need to be a roundabout because it's not really ferrying a lot of traffic. Um, I've connected one extra house up here, so maybe this house makes the odd journey in. Perhaps a more direct route from these guys as well could help. Um, we could disconnect... This is a really main connection for yellow as well is the difficult thing. It sort of has to stay. We could send the reds around a long way. Uh, in theory, by removing that road, we could actually speed this up. Let's try it. Let's try it. Uh, these blue houses as well can maybe get off this road. Um, it'll make their journey a little bit longer is the only issue, because now they'll have to really weave their way through some ugly traffic. Uh, is this getting serviced enough? Yes. Is this getting serviced enough? Absolutely not. Uh, actually, it's not terrible. I think that's got enough reach. We're just really low on blue houses, to be honest. Really low on blue houses. Looks like enough red cars are able to get to this now. I'm less worried. Cul-de-sacs as well would be a really useful tool if you could actually, like, have them in the game rather than having to sort of awkwardly draw them. Oh my goodness, look at these greens. Holy moly. They were they were so bored, they were having to, like, build a road between themselves. Because I'd failed to connect them. Sorry, team. <laughs> Jeepers, look at that expansion down. Oh, I see what the issue is. Oh boy, that's a big issue. That is a big issue. See you, Ben. Uh, the green... Green is a, all of a sudden a huge issue. <laughs> uh, mainly because of this one up the top here. So we're going to have to remove a motorway. I don't even know if I'm going to have time to do that. We need to get people over there as fast as possible. So I'm just going to have to build an interim bridge. For the minute. And then delete... Uh, oh, delete this motorway. Go back to my road tiles. How many do I have? I'm going to need... Okay, then what we'll do is connect that up like that. So blues still have sort of their own road they can use here. So they can still flow fairly smoothly. Fairly smoothly. Um... We just need to be able to place that motorway. And then we'll be A-OK. -okay. Uh, oh, for the time being, that needs to connect there. Oh, I think we're going to lose. They're all going to come flooding out of their houses, but I just don't know if they're going to make it there on time. I mean, they take this roundabout. They get there fairly quickly. Yep, they're doing it. Look at them go. 
let's speed them up. It's I just can't. T- it's painstakingly slow. I can't watch my defeat that slowly. Okay, we made it. We successfully made it. And you know what? Actually, that connection's pretty solid. I might just leave that. I really might just leave that as is. I think that's totally fine. In terms of my next pickup, I have no interest in traffic lights. Bridges, on the other hand, proving very useful indeed. Let's um, let's reconnect that up. That's a ridiculous journey. <laughs> These are all ridiculous journeys. <laughs> looking good we have now successfully completed over 600 and 50 650 journeys so we're looking good um oh that's an ugly place for a dark blue to be uh although i suppose it doesn't matter if it's just one so let's just feed these two they could just be little stragglers forever like this little blue one up in the top left that has had no one build near him forever it could just be exactly the same Time will tell, of course. The other difficult thing is actually just keeping track of everything that's appearing. Uh, this blue is just upgraded. Which actually puts quite a lot of pressure on these new blues to be connected over there quite quickly. And they're currently not. Uh, actually, they're really not. What we need is disconnect them... We've run out of road tiles, but it don't matter because we're just going to give them a direct motorway. Whammo. Straight over and into work. <laughs> you thought your commute was short? Look at these guys. Yellow, yellow, yellow. What is going on with yellow? Uh, blue is congesting it far too much. You're right. You're right. Uh, no name. Blue is... Actually, that's just the big issue, isn't it, really? That is just such an issue. This intersection is hideous. Hideous. Should it, it really should be a roundabout. Um, I'm wondering maybe if we take one from a low traffic area. We don't have any low traffic areas, though. By the way, this part of the neighborhood, can we just appreciate... Oh, this house has been left out, but can we just appreciate actually how good this part looks? So is that house. Whoops. Um, this side, though, is just an absolute mess. I'd just love to just rip it all up and start again, to be honest. Uh, but you can't do that because then you just instantly lose. So how can I fix this? What I most likely need to do is remove those traffic lights. Uh, for starters, because I don't understand how they work, and I think they just don't work very well for that reason. <laughs> um, a lot of these yellows don't even need to be using this if that is connected, right? These guys can connect down there. So we remove that connection altogether. Come on, you can do it. Help a brother out here. Right, we connect them up down there. Now they use this road to get to work and to get there, so this intersection's still super busy. However, this one should be a bit lighter. Uh, does that mess up red horribly? No, but we should connect these blues down here as opposed to onto either of these, I think, because that'll get messy. That'll get real messy. Uh, I also note that this is probably a waste of roads when we can... Oh, shoot. I have to unpause to get this to give me my roads back. No! <laughs> okay there's two these guys get connected up okay now we're getting them all back right because look i can connect that guy up with one road connect this guy up with fewer than that i think that just makes sense um yes this green's upgraded this is the very successful part of town we like this part a lot <laughs> Uh, have I solved these traffic woes? No, this is still absolutely horrendous and it needs a thank goodness! This is exactly what it needs! It needs a roundabout in a big way. Orbital woke up at 4am to watch this. Orbital, you did not. Stop it, but a very good morning to you. Now we've got roundabouts, this gets much more interesting because this whole area down the bottom left here, absolute shambles absolute shambles but a roundabout will solve all of its problems 
Uh, okay. First question. Where can it actually fit? Because they're kind of awkward. It can fit right there. That's beautiful. That is just music to my ears. Okay, so who's coming on and off this roundabout and where do they need to go? Yellows. Big yellow coming down this way, going to work. What side of the road do we drive on? We drive on the wrong side, don't we? Let me just check. Yeah, we drive on the right-hand side of the road in this game. The the incorrect side to drive on. So we're going to be coming around. So these guys, they're driving on the right... <laughs> having to, like... This is difficult for me because I drive on the left. So I'm having to, like, actually think... What, what, what way did the roundabout traffic go? It goes anti-clockwise that's why it feels so strange so these guys come onto the roundabout and they go around left so what i need to do is connect them can we go straight past no we can't but if we connect them on like that they can just sort of cruise on and off easy um now down at this left hand roundabout we need to also connect this yellow so they can come on around and off to work like that very smooth do I need to connect the reds up to this at all, or can we just funnel them around? We could potentially just funnel them around it, but oh um, what? <laughs> I don't think that's how roundabout work. <laughs> how does the roundabout work? Not like that. What is that? Please. That doesn't quite work either, but it's better. Okay. Roundabouts should just fix all of our problems, and they're gonna need to because Red is really struggling down here in a big way. Uh, in a huge way, but let's let's try it. Let's try it. Oh, and for anybody interested... Night mode? Let's try that. Uh, it also has this wonderful screenshot mode. Look at how cool this is. Amazing. That is so much fun. Night mode, day mode, no audio, audio. I'm not sure what this little film one does. I'm assuming it will take a wee video. Oh, so good. I'll keep the screenshot forever. And <laughs> but only keeping that right hand side in frame. <laughs> okay, let's continue. We crack on. Let's see how the roundabout does. Is it keeping on to- Oh, hello, beastie. Connect that up there. That actually should be fine. Are we keeping on top of the red? That is the question. That is the question. Shall we play in nighttime mode for a bit? Just to really try it out. Ooh, how do we feel about nighttime mode? I'm going to let it sink in for a little bit. See how I feel. Definitely easier on the eyes. Actually, it's quite nice. Quite nice indeed. Uh, what was that? Another greenhouse. Easy. We've got heaps of roads. We could bring this guy in, but... Oh my... Hold the phone. What is going on? We've got near collapse down here. We've got near collapse here. We've got near collapse here. We've got near collapse here. This is problematic. This is very problematic. Oh my goodness! Oh, Jackie! Jackie with the $5 super chat! Jackie says, Happy Snow Day! It is indeed a snow day, probably the one snow day of the year. <laughs> Thank you, Jackie. That's so generous and kind of you. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Unfortunately, it couldn't come at a worse time as my city seems to just be collapsing around me. Uh... I'm not really even sure how to salvage this at this point. I've definitely learned some lessons. <laughs> Might just let it play out. That green is almost faltering. Greens, it's a very slow journey for them to get here, I think, because of this right 
because the roundabouts are going the wrong way. <laughs> or the right way, shall I say. So much easier on my gamer eyes. Yeah, I, I agree. <laughs> so much easier. Let's keep it in night mode for a bit. Maybe for the rest of this, we'll just keep it in night mode. Actually, we might be keeping on top of it. I may have spoken too soon. It looks like everything is going A-OK. -okay. Or oh, this one is nearly popping. It's literally bouncing in and out of being on the timer. What that suggests is I need a slight way to speed up this. A motorway would do it. A motorway would definitely do it. In fact, I'm wondering if I could get two birds with one stone here. Can I also provide a quicker journey for people up here? Is what I'm wondering. I think the answer is yes. Unfortunately, I don't have a roundabout, but... In an ideal world, what have we got? 17 roads. So, what we're going to do is... Something a little bit funky. Oh, shoot. This is the edge of the map. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, That kind of changes things. I'm going to connect these up. Uh, that that can just go like that. What am I doing? Um, and then provide a motorway from here, I think all the way over somewhere here maybe straight to that green but then i'm thinking we could also use it to serve as red so it could be more beneficial to like flow in here at this roundabout let's try it let's just see what happens i'm gonna loop for now and have fun thank you jaggy <laughs> <laughs> appreciate it we've completed 1000 journeys now too how about that how about it can we safely speed up the clock again i reckon we probably can especially this new motorway looks to be working oh that's ugly uh how can i make this work that oh i don't know about that road it might work though actually it might work What about that? Does that work? I don't think that works, but I only have two road tiles. Can I connect this guy in two? Oh. Amazing. Amazing. Okay. Um, are we servicing everybody? Actually, yes, we are. There's a real demand for green. Gr that, that's actually a really silly connection. I've run out of road tiles. Please delete these two. <laughs> I really need these these roads back. Fine. <laughs> As you were. Um, what I want to do is just make these connections a bit smarter. Um, how close are we to the end of the week? We're actually very close to the end of the week. Uh, oh, this is a bit ugly though. Completely run out of road tiles. Um, any inefficiencies... That are really blindingly obvious. Oh, I can't delete any because I can't replace any because I have no spears. Let this be a lesson. Always have spears. Britney Spears. Um, oh, I don't know how this is going to go. Blue demand is absolutely skyrocketing. But I do not have the roads to satisfy it. We're on timer on two blues. Getting dangerous now on three blues. Whew! Let's get 30 road tiles. Okay. Blue boy. On. Blue. On. Uh, how can we connect anyone? Oh my goodness. Look at all these blues doing nothing. Blue. On. Blue. On. <laughs> uh, dark blue. Where are you going? Probably just over this motorway. So you can just connect up there. Okay, so we're on timer. Uh, there's a significant blue neighborhood forming up here. And their connection to workplaces is pretty ugly. They can get to this one easily. They can't get to this one very easily at all. This one is the hardest one to service by far. That leaves me wondering, how can I make it easier? Honestly, I don't really even see a way. Uh, all I've got is traffic lights and road tiles, but I don't even think any more road tiles would help. 
Uh, let's connect this here and try doing that to there. That might muck things up. Okay, we'll have to keep an eye on that. Uh, there was one other blue house. Oh, there. Oh, that's an ugly connection, but it might be okay. Particularly, we'll try some traffic lights there, keeping on that green. Uh, and see how we... That's actually really ugly. What is that? I can't make that any better. <laughs> I literally cannot. I mean, I could maybe uh, connect that house out the back there. I guess that works. Connect that one down like that. Just make it a bit smoother. All right, okay, let's try. Let's see if we can keep up with demand, but I'm really worried about that timer in the top right in particular. Is it too late? Am I a goner? I'm like panic building a road up here to try and allow these people to bypass in some way. <laughs> like I'm just doing whatever I can to try and shrink their journeys. Um, it's probably already too late. Join there. They've got a top road bypass now, which can sort of send them around and through. Uh, can increase some efficiencies here by doing that. This road perhaps is too congested. Let's try sending this yellow out there. Uh, could also ease congestion on the roundabout. Although, actually... Yeah, no, that's probably fine. Okay. I feel like I've just got on top of it and just got it to a point where it's reliable and is, is probably going to work and now I'm going to lose. <laughs> but let's see. Let's just see how it plays out. Ooh, that's a lot of badness happening at once. Uh, uh, yeah, <laughs> it's kind of stressful. What was a relaxing game is now turned rapidly stressful at an alarming rate. Almost overwhelming. Oh, we're about to time out on this one in the middle. It's going. Oh my God. Drive in there. Oh, it was up the top. We made it for 79 days. 79 days. Take a picture, because it lasts longer. Um, obviously, to remember this momentous occasion. Wabamo. And I think we'll try, I think we'll try one more. Should we do one more? Do we have time for one more? I think we have time for one more. Jump back to the main menu, and you'll see they have some pretty cool, like, daily challenges and stuff as well. Um... We've got four cities to play on. I reckon we just jump straight for the hard one. Let's just go straight to it, shall we? Clearly we've proven ourselves as urban design masters. Yeah, why not? Okay, let's roll. Uh, the middle of the map is likely to be around here. So let's spring a nice road up. Okay, way to prove me wrong. It's fine. Bloop. Everything's fine. This is easy. Speed me up, buttercup. Two red houses, red building. We've got Coco Beach to the right. Love it. Um, I think we can't build through the trees. I think they're sort of the game's way of doing a hazard. Um, just to reiterate, this is Mini Motorways. You can get it on Steam at the moment. Uh, and you can also, I believe, pick it up uh, on the Apple Arcade. So, any Apple Arcade players, you can pick this up. Uh, anyone with iOS access, I believe, can get a trial for Apple Arcade too. I could be totally wrong, but I, I think I think that's a thing. So, you can potentially even just play it for free. You can potentially even just play it for free. You cannot, unfortunately, add another entrance onto these shops, nor can you change it. It's one of the sort of design... Uh, constraints to the game. It may be a... Well, I mean, it, it actually wouldn't be too easy if you could change the direction of the shops, I don't think, personally. But it's probably a balancing thing. Roundabouts all day, because I can already see a really useful roundabout going right here. In fact, let's just do that. We're going to future-proof ourselves and just fang a roundabout there. Let's connect that house that way. 
Um, and then we could probably do something a bit smarter here as well. That is a horrendous connection. What is that? Can you not just... Oh, okay, well, screw me then. <laughs> nah, that's fine. We'll just keep blue... We'll just keep this this red road just running over the side of this blue factory. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's totally fine. <laughs> oh my goodness, you couldn't have planned it better if it was planned. Uh, it actually could have been planned a little bit better. Um, because... Firstly, these guys, not so hot. Let's wriggle them, wriggle them around like that. Um, and probably, oh, okay. Uh, I'll take a bridge. Probably try and redirect this house over there and direct that down that way. Um, and actually, actually, up there is, a, I'm not sure if that's a terrible idea or a great idea. Is that a... That's probably a terrible idea. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. This roundabout services these two factories and all of the houses. Great. It, it's not the... Oh, for goodness. Okay, no, actually, this is fine too. This is also everything is... Look, these houses have merged together. They love each other that much. Everything's fine. I'm not sure about our future growth potential in this city. That is of some slight concern, I'll admit. But... Everything seems to be going okay. So I'm just going to keep playing on high speed. We're nearly at the 100 successfully completed Uber Eats journey mark. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> everything's fine let's get another roundabout i think we've got a bridge up our sleeves already and i don't know if we're ever even gonna have to use it it doesn't look i mean i don't know how big this level gets actually actually we'll see okay right why would the road ever want to do that <laughs> it's just insane there's no there's no logic to it at all um anyway uh so we're blue connected to blue light blue connected to light blue yellow connected to everything's fine everything's fine let's keep rolling through what uh game do i think it's overrated Ooh, i would have to think on that for a tad yeah definitely man at the guns uh if you're playing hearts of iron you'll want that i'd have to work a little bit more seriously to get some proper recommendations on Hearts of Iron. Uh, just, just looking at the live chat, by the way, for those of you watching the VOD afterwards or unfamiliar, what, why is he talking about Hearts of Iron all of a sudden? That's why. I just answer a few live questions as I go, uh, if they relate to the game, but also other ones. It's, it's a fun thing to do. Anyway, I want the motorway. <sighs> the cost of road tiles, which is always quite iffy, but I think it's worth doing. Uh, can we connect these houses on a bit more of a sleek angle. I think angles are key here. That way the main road has fewer fewer uh, abrupt sort of... Oh no! Oh yes! You know, fewer sort of uh, ab uh, abrupt angles and T... Uh, sorry, cross intersections. We don't want cross crossroads. We do not want crossroads. Also... Oh, it has to weave like that. That's hideous. Uh, okay, so we have purples and blues commingling up the top left. Usually, not sure about commingling, but in this instance, uh, I think I'll allow it. <laughs> uh, the the vod gets uploaded afterwards, usually unedited, usually unedited. I would trust Pixel to build my city. Oh, I don't know if you should really trust me. <laughs> Although. So far, so good. If, of course, your city design is is uh, designed around segregation, which is obviously a terrible way to actually design a city. Um, I want another roundabout. I think this is going fantastically well. Fantastically well. Like, I'm, like, on the fastest speed thinking, come on, th throw me a challenge. Throw me a freaking bone here. I've got 
a motorway, spear. I've got lots of bridges, do I? I have no bridges, lol. But I have three roundabout spear and nothing to do with them. And these factories or shops, whatever they are, are just appearing in the perfect spots for me. Look at this. Oh boy. <laughs> uh, potentially, this is quite a long journey. It may need a motorway in future, but for now, I think that's totally fine. Um, we could think about connecting these houses in a different way. Like we'll send some of these ones straight down this way and we'll send some of these ones straight this way. Um, and that might just help to one, reduce congestion and two, help sort of direct the cars in the direction that they should be going rather than just wherever the AI spits them out. So I'm just going to tweak these roads down the bottom here to sort of spit them that way. Let's grab another motorway. Love me some motorways. Although yet, as I say, we haven't really even had to use them. Here's our first annoying house. Uh, someone who decided not to build in the right area, right? These yellow folk, they love the south. These guys, not sure what they're up to. But what we could do for them is... I was going to say we could future-proof this area by plopping a roundabout down, but there's already one right here, so it's probably overkill. Let's um, connect this community up and bring this out here like so. And then we're probably going to use a motorway here to... It, it's a little bit of a waste, but I don't really have a better use for it at the moment. Um... Let's actually disconnect them entirely. They do not need to be connected to that road. They do not need to be connected to that road. They simply be need, need to be connected to these workplaces. So let's pop motorway there. Fang it across the top. It's basically an overpass at this point. <laughs> oh, I love that. Let's just sort of cover up... I don't know. I kind of want to see everything under it is the annoying thing. I guess I don't really need to see that intersection, but I need to see this building, so let's do that. Um, I think that probably sorts everything, and we can just whammo, fam, straight back into high speed. <laughs> don't jinx me, but feeling pretty confident about this. I think we're in a good spot. Oh, the motorways are fantastic because they're so high speed as well. They just work so well, so unbelievably well. Uh, let's connect these odds and sods houses up to exactly where they should be going. That looks like kind of an unyielding waste of roads. However, oh my goodness, okay. Uh, we've had some other awkward things develop, which is probably going to change my entire, uh, plan here now. I think I'm probably going to get rid of this motorway straight away. What are these people doing up here? Please. I mean, really? Okay, so we've got a little blue neighborhood that needs to be connected down here. We also have a red neighborhood down here. What this makes me think is, can I squeeze a roundabout in anywhere? No! No, we should future-proof ourselves by fanging out a couple of roundabouts in spots where I don't yet need them. Um, hmm, okay, so if we can motorway this, motorway these guys to here as well. This is a quick fix rather than a long-term solution. But if we just motorway in, what on earth are you doing? Pliz. Sure, we'll just motorway right into their homes. <laughs> Direct line to work. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. These reds are pretty difficult, especially because I don't really have the capacity to get another bridge across for them. So they're going to have to... What are you doing? I'm going to have to sort of loop up like... Oh, why would you do this game? Why? That is so horrendously ugly in every way. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> There's no easy way to do it. It has to be done. <laughs> oh, yuck. Okay. So these reds can now hook up to this yellow road. They then need to immediately get off it. And connect up to the red route. It's an unfortunate commingling, but if it doesn't screw up traffic, it should be fine. Hopefully. Hopefully.
But that's right, Orbital, when in doubt, build a roundabout. And I would have loved to, I just couldn't quite fit one in there. It's a really crammed space. Uh, traffic lights are a total waste of time in my opinion. We can avoid crossroads altogether so we can avoid the need to even use them. Let's get some road tiles. 33, that's nice, although I'm a little bit worried about what that means the game is about to throw at me. Uh, this intersection actually doesn't even need to be a T, does it? We can just connect you to there and you to there. Keep this flowing as freely as possible. That's the objective. Here is, I was about to say here's a difficulty, but it's actually not. Why would you curve like that? <laughs> I'm just gonna rage at this until the cows come home. Um, okay, you down there like that, and you in there like that, but please, a little bit better. Thank you. <laughs> uh, and then we'll connect that one in the back there. And how about that? Sorry, just redo this <laughs> properly. Uh, no, that's still pretty hideous. Oh, why you do this to me? Oh, that's fine. Okay. This actually is looking really... Oh, please. Hmm, do I need this red house? I don't think so. Um, this is looking really good. My concern is the journey for these reds is a really long one. This red is useless at the moment and needs to be connected up like that. Um, perhaps roundabout is the pick here. When in doubt, drop a roundabout. It's the pick for sure. Let's just take a wee stock tank. Um, we may need to roundabout through here and start to commingle these blues. Just because I don't think the reds are flowing fast enough to the red neighborhood. So, let's connect up a proper blue neighborhood. The way only true blues would desire it to be. Uh, as segregated. <laughs> um, and then... <laughs> Let's, uh, anyway, let's remove that. Let's fang a roundabout in awkwardly right up next to that shop. Sure. Connect them in. Make this a main road and connect it up like that. Uh, and then this intersection can probably change a bit too. These guys can connect straight to it. We'll give them a, uh, no, not like that, actually. These guys can connect straight to it like this, uh, which will give them a slightly faster way onto it, and hopefully this traffic will all just filter through fine. Uh, and then we'll give them a direct pop in here. Uh, or oh, that could be ugly. There we go. That's That probably fixes that. Um, it's also a little bit of an issue here. Eh, it fixes it slightly. Also, what is this? It's funny when you go back and look at things, when you review things, you're like, why did I even think that was ever a good idea? <laughs> uh, there is no real way to connect that red, is there? What goodies do I have to play with? I have another roundabout. Uh, no, I think we're all good. Let's jump straight back into fast speed. Catch up on lost time. The south was so clean, but red and blue joined and now it looks scuffed. Oh, I know. Like, what are they doing? Like, what is this? This guy can't even go anywhere. <laughs> Literally, this person can go nowhere. Um, otherwise, oh, purple, 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 please. Red has frustratingly built in some really awkward spots there. Um, which we can actually get around by going like that. Um... Oh, it's heartbreaking to cross through here, but I think we're going to do it just because otherwise... <sighs> Frustratingly, otherwise there really isn't any other great way to do it. We are now fully commingling, I think, almost every color. Um, oh my goodness! Oh, Benjamin, thank you. My blues in the middle weren't connected. That was probably no name thanks as well. Shoot, I didn't even notice. Whew. You may have just saved my bacon there just in the nick of time too to keep up with demand. Uh, I would love another bridge to sneak across like that to connect these two blues, which are currently doing nothing. I don't think it's worth commingling to connect two blues though. 
So I won't do that yet. We can connect that blue up pretty easily. So let's do that. Uh, brilliant. Okay, bridge. Exactly what I wanted. Couldn't have worked it out better. So let's add... Whoa, not like that. Let's just bridge straight over into there. And connect this guy up to it too. Now we have successfully disconnected this blue from the yellow. The yellows still sort of have their own their own patch. They have to share a bridge with red, which is like kind of annoying. They don't really love that, but it is what it is. Uh, uh, more red houses in the exclusion zone. Uh, I don't like that at all. Um, not really a lot I can... Oh, red demand is spiking though. Uh, at this shop in particular. Oh, jeepers. Urgh, you had to build on that road, didn't you? Oh. You're killing me, game. Um, really doing it to me. Is there any way to improve the transport access to this shop from Reds? Um, here's one. Feed this guy straight into it. That's a great start. I think this roundabout connection needs to remain. Not sure what that little road is doing. That's fine. Um, can these guys connect up any faster? They actually can. They can connect up a great deal faster. In fact, we can sort of even send them that way. Um, by doing that. That'll sort of herd them along. Uh, in an ideal world, I would probably connect another motorway. I'm wondering, this motorway doesn't need to be here at all now. Because these two houses can service this one factory. What that means is I'll have a motorway to play with in a second. Because, as soon as these really slow cars complete their journeys, I'll have a motorway to play with. Now that matters, because we can potentially ferry some reds that would otherwise have no or very little access to Redville straight in. And other colours may be able to make use of it as well. Um, so I think it's probably most useful over... here or here in terms of future proofing just trying to think like these two reds service this factory and they're actually enough to do that um once they catch up with demand these three reds go here only basically these guys move to this one these all of these guys have to awkwardly ferry their way up to these, don't they? That's why this one is particularly problematic in this one, because it's too slow. It's too slow. So let's just, um, what is this road? Let's just kind of like, Huji Watts it some of these out of here. Right? All of you guys, what are you doing? You, get lost. You, see you later. Now, nah, let's get our handy dandy freaking roundabout there let's just get rid of this one i think that was just there as a placeholder anyway um let's go into build mode let us bring yellow on off <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You guys drive on the wrong side of the road, so it needs to be like that, right? Right hand side? Yeah, 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 yeah. So yellow have the smooth on and off, right? So it's smooth for them. Reds can use it as well. Okay. You know where I'm going with this. Reds, you are going this way now. All of you. You're all going this way. Out to here. Connecting to the shop as well, so it's still useful. Um, and then connecting to what on earth are you doing connecting to connecting to a road that comes out of the about not like that fine we'll screw it up for the yellows connecting to this okay motorway all the way to who needs it the most you or you probably both of you really should we just drop them right here? Then they can just make up their own mind. I just don't want to congest things too poorly. 
But sure, let's drop them just before the, before the motorway. Uh, and then hook them up. And hook that up. Uh, should it be a four-way intersection? No. That house probably doesn't need to be on the main intersection to it. <laughs> it can probably just, like, sort of loop in back here somewhere. No? Fine, it can just go there. Uh, okay, let's try this. I think this will be faster, potentially. Uh, I might just keep that connection there as well, just in case they need to slip through, in case it's faster for some of these guys to go to this roundabout than get all congested through this absolutely dreadful way. Likewise there. Let's just keep these transport routes, but give this main one, uh, which I'm actually going to throw somewhere else, I think. Maybe somewhere a bit further along. There, potentially. Yeah. And then let's bring that to there so it doesn't look like entirely stupid. Um, no, that actually looks entirely stupid. <laughs> let's try it. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Read the infestation that just will not stop. Oh, bye, Orbital. Hello, Marty. Belted. How you doing? Well, 1,000 journeys in, everything's coming up in Millhouse, really. Um, I think this motorway may have fixed our woes, although actually up here is still horrifically slow. Is anyone coming here? Oh, man, that is slow. Um, okay, hold up. Let's drop them in here as planned. I think. And this intersection looks like it's causing big problems. I think separating... Ugh. Hold on. Hold on. Separating it out. It's quite fiddly. I'm not gonna lie. But we just gotta... There we go. Okay, let's let that play out. I wonder if we should do that. I should probably just spit these guys straight there. Okay, brilliant. Let's get some more roundabouts. Uh, connect these guys up to this one. Might as well. It's already there. <laughs> Let's use it. I don't see why not. Quite lucky in that we still only have one pink shop. Uh, we'll connect these guys together. They can have their own little weird road. Uh, this yellow is now timing out. Have I starved it of people? Oh, that is a pretty difficult journey to make for them, isn't it? That is a really tough journey. Perhaps a more direct route. This purple house is sort of really ruining it, that for me. Um... Hmm, well we actually don't need three purple houses to be connected whereas this connection here is pretty important so what are you doing let's connect these guys up directly that will speed them up a bit and and keep that fueled quite easily i think because it is just a small one so it shouldn't be a problem what's going on with this blue this intersection is causing absolute nightmares isn't it coming off that motorway yeah, it is. What would actually be more beneficial would be to have the motorway coming in somewhere a little quieter. Like there. That's the stupidest motorway of all time. Like, why did you build that motorway? It's like two tiles long. But it actually is such an important overbridge for the connection of the city. <laughs> like, the, the city would not function without at all without this overbridge. It keeps this roundabout running smoothly. This intersection is a bit hideous, but it's working. Oh my goodness! Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Okay, um... This shop is about to time out. Because I, to be honest, didn't even see it. Look at all these pinks over here. What on earth? We've got no motorways. I was just praising how great this motorway is for general traffic flow and function and now I'm like I might need to rip it out no one's using it right now are they I 
doesn't look like it. Let's connect it straight in there. And hook these guys straight up to it. Uh, or oh, what to do about this mess now, though? These blue houses are now completely disconnected. They're all connected together, but they're not connected to anything, and I have seven roads to get them here, and no tools other than roundabouts. I think we're going to have to roundabout it. Will one fit? Aye, 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 senorita, it won't. Uh, okay, the best I can do is down here. Which isn't actually terrible. Let's see what we can do. Whew! Wow. Okay, it's ugly as sin, but it works. Oh man, that actually works really well. Let's hope I've done enough to save this in time. I'm really worried. Top 10 plays of the week right here. I'm really worried about this purple on the bottom. Oh, I'm not sure what's going to happen, but let's let's give it a uh, let's give it a whirl and see. I'm going to put it on normal speed. This car can now finally leave its house. Two of them. They're stuck in traffic. Does the game not realize these two cars are the most important cars in the world right now? <laughs> Come on, people. Okay, look, here come the cavalry, speeding along State Highway 1, like there's no tomorrow. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Oh my goodness, and they just get there in time to start reducing the clock. Unfortunately, we've fixed that problem, but we've created ten more. We now have massive, massive backlogs over here in Blueville, as these cars desperately try and get through. What they need... Is this alternative route? Most certainly that is what they need. In fact, it should be the only route. It should absolutely be the only route. That was absolutely my balls up there. Um, that, uh, yeah, that's a big mistake. It may cost us as well it may just cost us actually uh if this if these guys don't get on top of this issue uh, which it looks like they will oh it's really iffy let's see timers are just going off everywhere no the roundabout has completely stopped working Oh, the roundabouts completely stopped working. Um, more roundabouts aren't going to save me here. This is so horrifically congested. Ugh. You can build a wee access road down here. Filter even more people to this shop. The trouble is this intersection is hideous. Um, and it might even be too late to fix it, but... What I would ideally do is something like that. Right? That 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 would have fixed it. Uh, it was just a poor intersection planning that sort of screwed that up. I'm surprised that this one still works. Like, it should really be... Uh, whatever, it is what it is. <laughs> uh, oh, this doesn't look good, friendos. Let's see. Lots of timers going off around the city. Oh no, look at this roundabout. This roundabout is going to lose me the game, and I don't think there's anything I can do to stop it. Uh, what is trying to happen? Red are trying to leave, blue are trying to get through. 
there you go, blue. Problem solved. Well, now the red's completely disconnected. Which is a problem. But what if we just bang them down like that? Let's try it. It's too late. It's too late. We're, we're gone. We're sunk. She's all over. It's an absolute disaster. That roundabout. After praising the roundabouts. Oh, uh, it's, we're just done. It's, a, it's the, just, blah, 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 blah. it's just chaos. <laughs> oh, do you even want to save this one to memory? Dar es Salaam. Should we put some clouds around it? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, well. We tried. We tried. <laughs> SimCity 4 traffic, literally, like City Skylines traffic. <laughs> anyway, look, that will conclude this uh, stream uh, slash video today, if you're watching the VOD afterwards. Hopefully you enjoyed my reasonable effort at putting some of my city planning skills to good use, although in reality, really, this is of course an example of very bad city planning, because you're just trying to keep the colours as segregated as possible, rather than focusing on traffic flow. Next time I play it, I'd like to throw that logic out the window, and instead purely look at it from like a logical transport planning, logistics, urban design perspective. How can I make this city as livable as possible? As if it were a real city. I think that would be really fun to try next time, but hopefully you enjoyed it. Something a little bit different, uh, at a little bit of a different time, so maybe catch a few, um, different people than normal maybe you don't have to stay up quite as late or get up quite as early uh, thank you very much for joining me everybody and until next time uh, take care and i'll see you then bye bye everyone